Hey everyone, welcome back to Figure Fantasy. So before we proceed, I'd like to put out this disclaimer. This, guys, is just purely speculation based on the Chinese version of Figure Fantasy or Figure Story. So this is not yet confirmed, but most likely she will be dropping based on the clues that I've found in the Chinese version. Okay, so it's going to be Ayane Okade. So let's take a look at where I was able to find her. Okay, guys, in this May 2021 post, there were two figures here that were dropped. So one of them is her and the other one is Norris. Okay, so as you remember, Norris just dropped um, a, couple of, uh, a couple of days ago. So they were both dropped in the same update. So another update after this one is... This one. So June 25, 2021, the next update contained both uh, Rin and Ai Hinohara. So both Rin and Norris dropped simultaneously. Then I was able to tease um, Ai Hinohara because she appeared in the story for the game. That is how I, I came into the conclusion that she will be dropping next week. Um, probably around um, January 21. So let's take a look at her kit, guys, and see if she's a worthwhile uh, figure to invest in. Okay, so we have here an um, evaluation in performance of Ayane Okada. This is actually based on the Japanese version as well. There are lots of versions for this game, so a lot of sources for me to mine. So please bear with me, guys, and bear with the translation because some of them are are hard to understand as well. I'll be putting a link to um, their their site for the Japanese, uh, uh, th this one, the Japanese guide. So as you can see here, performance of Ayane Okada, she is uh, given a 10 out of 10 points so very strong um she's going to be a defender and she's going to be with galatea let's just confirm it down here below um so as you can see here so she's heavy equipment which is defender and galatea so this will be a big help for you guys and for also for me who have been craving for a very good defender for galatea and it's about time because um um, we really need a very good defender badly, especially if um, for the game, if you need um, more frontline, if you need to have three frontline defenders, she would be a good addition to your team. So let's take a look at um, the skills of uh, Ai Hinohara. So she covers every content and she is playable. So at this point, guys, um, I would advise you to save your currency, save your diamonds for her because definitely everybody should be pulling for her. So as for Akadi Ayani's skills, her attack, her basic attack is priority given to the front enemy in the same horizontal row as you. Inflicts uh, for her level up effect, inflicts additional damage if the target is frozen. Okay, so this is actually going to be good. So you're going to need um, to combo her with uh, figures that um, get that the freeze or, you know, freeze opponents increases normal attack damage by 25%. Okay, so she's going to be part of your uh, Frost team uh, moving forward. And she would definitely be a good addition. So for her ultimate, so energy is going to be 60 and energy recovery is 6 per second. So the effect is randomly damages nearby enemies every 0 0.5 seconds for 3 seconds after the ultimate is activated. Okay, and as, seven, and as a 70% chance of freezing the target for 0 0.9 seconds, probability is affected by hit or by, um, this is going to be accuracy. Okay, so randomly damages nearby enemies uh, nearby. So I am thinking that this is going to be um, only a few or all. It's not indicated here on how many she'll be damaging uh probably all i think 
So and she applies uh she applies what do you call this? She freezes them as well. 70% chance. So that's a good uh what do you call it, percentage to have. So for the level up effect for her ultimate, if the target freezes, the damage is increased by 25% and the frozen state is extended up to 1.5 seconds. So that is going to be uh what do you call this? This is going to be 0 0.9 plus 1.5. So that's nearly two to three seconds so that's very long already um the ultimate is every 0 0.05 seconds so i think this is going to be everybody i think just don't quote me on that so i'm just reading through the translation and the last uh, level up effect is each time the the ultimate has a has a hits an obstructed enemy it gains an additional shield and in, and increases its defense for eight seconds so I'm not sure what obstructed enemy means or maybe it has a shield. So it, it, she gains a shield herself. So she is she has uh, she has a uh, freeze, she has shield and what else does she has? Um for her passive here when the HP of of the figure or an ally figure becomes 50% or less Earn a large amount of shield only once. So this is going to be only once. Uh, I think this is only once per battle. So make sure that um, make sure that uh, you know this and don't expect this every time um, HP goes below fifty percent. So level up effect for the skill for level two when Ayani gives a shield to an ally, she gets ten energy which is good because she needs to recycle her ultimate as quick as possible after ayani activates uh, her ultimate you and allies with the lowest hp other than yourself get a shield as well so her passive is mainly protecting herself and protecting her allies with shields so definitely a big big plus to your galatea team so for for your special skill Frost story, when attacked, there is a 25% chance that the damage will be reduced by 50%. Uh, leveled up effect, increase on attack by 5% and defense by 10%. When attacked, there is a 35% chance that the damage will be reduced by 50%. Okay, so as you can see here, guys, she is going to be one of the best defensive figures that we're going to be having so as early as now i'm telling you guys that that's why i put out this video because i'm telling you guys to save up currency for her you still have one week to more or less save up for her if she drops on january 21 but i'm sure she's going to be um i'm sure that there's a high probability that she's going to be dropping soon if not next Probably the figure after the next one. But uh, based on what you've seen earlier, in terms of the two recent up the, uh, the, the the two previous updates in in the Chinese version, um, she's gonna drop definitely after the three that was that already dropped recently. Okay, guys, so that is it so far. So what are your thoughts with uh, Ayani Okadi? So please share them in the comment section below. I'd like to hear your thoughts on uh, on how she will be impacting your team also on if you're going to be summoning for her um, like what I'm going to do if she drops in global version. Okay, guys, so thank you very much for staying this far. Please consider subscribing because this helps my channel a lot. And also, please don't forget to click that bell icon. Thank you, guys. Stay safe. Take care. This is The Warden, and I'm out of here.